The Big Three League makes a huge shift, removing several big stars from the team and finding others. Stay tuned to see who is now out of the league after just the third week. Hey guys, I'm Britt Johnson. Make sure you follow me on social media at I am Britt Johnson and click subscribe to join the Fumble Fam if you haven't already. The Big Three League has only been around since 2017, but has already become one of the summer fan favorites for the sports world. With former big time NBA players joining the three on three league, fans flock to get a chance to see if some of their favorite players still got game. The league takes place over the summer on the weekends and has now gone from an eight team league to a 12 team league and moved from Fox Sports 1 to a new TV deal with CBS. With the rapid growth of the league comes a huge responsibility for fans and players. In a newly released statement by the league, they announced some changes effective immediately. CBS tweeting this statement saying this, After a series of consultations with players, coaches, and league leadership, Big 3 will be implementing the following changes set to take effect immediately. Such changes are being implemented to maximize competition, protect the health of players, and to raise the level of professionalism of the Big Three. As the premier professional three-on-three -three league in the world, we are always striving to improve the quality of both the live and broadcast experience for our fans, as well as the level of competition. In addition, the smooth running of our internal organization, while in great shape for the young third year league, needs to be improved and ongoing changes will continue to be implemented and finalized by next Monday. Effective immediately, Baron Davis, Bonzi Wells, Lamar Odom, and Jermaine O'Neal will be deactivated for the 2019 Big Three season. Glenn Big Baby Davis will be fined significantly for behavior detrimental to the league this past weekend, but will be eligible for Power's Saturday game as it has been determined a suspension is not required given the level of the fine. Several league personnel changes will also be made in order to maximize communication and the smooth running of league operations. Shortly after the release, Mike Ayers tweeted this. Well, that was quick, Lamar Odom already out of the big three. He only played in week one, admitting he felt lost during it. Hashtag big three. Baron Davis, who played in the NBA from 1999 to 2012, one of those teams being with my Clippers, and is a two-time NBA All-Star, tweeted this announcing his departure from the Big Three League as well. I have decided to no longer participate in the Big Three. I don't feel it is in my best interest to play. All love to the guys, stay connected and protect yourself. Ice Cube, good looking and best of luck. So why were these actions taken? Well. Glenn Davis was ejected from the Powers game against Trilogy for arguing with referees last weekend, and he made sure he left the court in style. Check this out. Big Baby just got ejected. We saw that coming. I mean, that, that came from the frustration early on. Look at Big Baby. Dang, Big Baby got in a lot bigger since his playing days, but he sure does still know how to entertain people. The four guys that were deactivated were said to be released not for off-the-court issues. ESPN reporting this. Per those with knowledge of the situation, Odom, Jermaine O'Neal, Bonzi Wells, and Baron Davis were deactivated for competitive reasons and not due to any off-the-court issues. Odom was not up to it from a competitive standpoint, a source said. So what do you guys think of the Big Three League? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, click subscribe, and shop the Fumble store for the latest game day gear. I'm your host, Britt Johnson for the Fumble, and I'll see you soon.